All right, story number two, story number two. Now, I just find this funny. I find this funny. I know Diddy News, you know, is is very dark. Uh, it is very uncomfortable. There's a lot of victims, and I think for a lot of people, um, you know, we're all hoping to see justice served. But Ray J, uh, you know, Ray J always has something to say, something colorful to say. He truly is one of the most interconnected artists, period. Interconnected people, period. I mean, just the number of relationships he's had and tentacles and entertainment that <laughs> seem to cross through Ray J is always ever expanding. So, of course, he had something to say about this Diddy situation. Uh, so we're going to react to this. This is a couple of weeks old, maybe, maybe almost, maybe almost two weeks old. But I just find this very entertaining. So let's take a look. There's a lot of people out here taking from people. Not only like like people are pe people are getting robbed of not only their money and their spirituality, they're getting robbed of their womanhood and manhood. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> Look at Ray J's face. One second applause for Ray J's face. Asses are being taken in ways <laughs> that nobody can explain. <laughs> wait, what did he say? <laughs> we go, wait, 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 let's just see that one more time. <laughs> Asses are being taken in ways that nobody can explain. Do you chuckle? Do you laugh? Do you help? Do you help is crazy. <laughs> Ray J's, do you help is crazy. <laughs> oh my God. Do you criticize? Because I see a lot of jokes out there right now talking about baby oil. Everybody got a joke about having baby oil and lube. Is that okay? Is that the message? <laughs> that was funny, fam. Now what? <laughs> I'm sorry. Ray J's a comedian. He is a talented, he's a talented, talented artist all the way around. But look at his face. Ray J's undefeated. I don't use baby oil. Lube sometimes in sex makes it better. <laughs> I'm taking Ray J as, as, as this being a commercial for one of his, uh, some new project he has maybe. Maybe this is a, 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 a some sort of spoof news show he has. I'm not sure. I've just been. I just came across this in the past week, and to be honest, like there's a lot of truth said in jest, and I think this is a great example of that phrase. There's a lot of truth said in said in jest, and this is a great example of that. You know, there are a lot of people joking about baby oil. You know, I mean, you guys actually got a lot of you guys got upset at me for reacting to the Diageo theory and not being as out front about the victims in that piece. And I, that's fair criticism. You know, it's definitely fair criticism. I take that every day of the week. And, you know, there is a dark side to everything around this. Actually, everything around this is dark, you know, around the, this Diddy situation. And the, at that allegations list is long is very long. And so I understand the sincerity and the care it takes to report on this. And I, that video wasn't a great example of that. This one right here really strikes me because I personally think Ray J is playing a character. I think he's joking here. And I actually think everything he's saying is really funny. And at the same time, I really wonder about Ray J's experience. I mean, Ray J is one of the most well-connected people, period. You know what I mean? And I know people around this are, you know, a ton of people worry about reputational risk. A lot of people have brand concerns, of course. A lot of people are getting hit up by lawyers. I feel like Ray J probably is hitting up. I have no information on this. This is just me talking. And watching this, I wonder what Ray J's seen or what his experiences have been. Because I personally feel like Ray J's probably been to, probably been going to Diddy parties, invited, invited at least since Moesha, whatever show he was on. I'm not saying that he's experienced anything or contributed to anything, but all of this commentary 
Asses are being taken in ways nobody could imagine. In a sardonic, very dark humor kind of way, coming from Ray J, it just kind of hits different. Because I personally feel like Ray J has enough experience, he has enough, uh, uh, enough relationships to be able to answer a lot of questions that most people have when it comes to this case. And I'd be shocked if Ray J wasn't getting hit up by lawyers looking for information <laughs> around this situation. So the show is called Reality Check with Ray J. I'm not sure how he plans to distribute this. I'm not sure if this is coming soon. I don't have that much information. I found this humorous. Um, and at the same time, there's a lot of truth said in jest. And coming from Ray J, this particular piece of comedy, in my opinion, holds a lot of weight. It really does. Let me know what you guys think of this in the comment section. My name is Justin Hunt. Like and subscribe to the channel. Follow at the company man on everything. It's all happening. Justin Hunt is here. It's all happening. Justin Hunt is here. It's all happening. The mathematical breakdown of this mighty game of rap we in. It's boom thapping. Systematical culture views us radical. It's all happening. Shake your hands and dabbing it. Life through the lens of hip hop from trip hop to yes, yes, dog, you don't stop, you don't, you don't stop, stop. Justin Hunt is here, it's all happening. It's all happening, yes, it's all happening. Justin Hunt is here, it's all happening. It's all happening, yes, it's all happening.